definitely on the chaos side of things. They certainly do love to be on that for a lot of the time, unless they get super serious in playoffs, and then they really come out into that, I guess, their final form. But again, we saw a big blade their own King Purge. And PYL actually found hard here. Imp's going to come in and get aggressive. TBQ, you know, joining with a snowball, but an exhaust's going to come down. Punishes here with Amy as well. PYL already dead. Heal popped as Flame is ported into the top side as well. And LG going to try and navigate now a 4v3. Flashes there, get used as Flame's forced to hop and flash away. Imp gets a kill into Amy, but it looks like he might go down. Three-man boomerang's not enough. Punish gets the next kill, and we start the game almost exactly the same. Run away with the lane, even in a counter match. Imp is so aggressive, but a good bait here for UP. Amy's in back in the top side. Imp has no summoners. He's actually going to re-all him, but a flay going to keep him safe. He eats the tower hit, and Amy gets an easy kill. I think it was smart of him to go grab spell shield. By Siva to keep herself safe, but Imp, he's just going back in. He gets played there, forced to use the heal, pops the ulti. PYL tries to find it, but doesn't get the exhaust is down. Imp's gonna die. Hard will get credit for that kill. Box on the PYL is gonna secure the second. And a misstep there. Oh my god, Scat might be able to turn it around. PYL gets it, but dies in the magical journey. Hard actually gets the double as TVQ channels the ulti to try and get this Thresh. He's gonna maybe die for you. The Snowball's doing good damage and PBQ needs one more, but he has to flash for it. Flash Snowball for the kill. Long in the top lane, diving on the flame. That's an easy kill and it's chaos across the rim. So Amy gonna ride back in and Imp is far too far forward here in this lane without a tower to run to. He's gonna get flanked. The box goes down. Imp's gonna die. Scatch might even get the kill and does. Even get, even get the kill credit on who, exactly who they want to. Flame has already teleported in. He's going in there. Exhaust comes through. Good Wallop actually coming in as the Nah. Gets on the heart and scatch. Good ulti though from Amy to counter. It's Godfrey. He's joined in. TBQ gets hooked up by the Thresh. He's taking a little too much damage as Punish comes down and gets the kill. And Punish indeed their two kills. Gold lead. Just watching to see what Flame builds. Looks like it's going to be Farmy Cinder Imp is again. still here. Good Q there from PYL. Long's going to die to Imp. And it's been a crazy long extended team fight. But steals the Gromp and now going to get aggressive onto Long. He's trying to make his life hell here as TBQ's coming up as well. Flame actually needs Mega. No, it's not quite close enough. TBQ going to come back in. Flame building up Rage quickly. Punish goes in. Q lands there for LeBlanc. Long gets the kill. Ulti's out onto Punish, but it's not enough to kill him. Now Godby going to try and line it up. Just needs one more Q. He tries to be in good line there, but he doesn't get the kill. And now Amy He's up here, ulti goes through, Long gets another, TBQ's dead, that's three for zero. Where you're losing CS in multiple lanes, not quite a bottom if you include the Targons. Good by PYL. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Journey a bit too magical there, ulti actually spell shielded I think there, but good. Hail of Arrow is going to keep him safe, never mind, Punish comes in, Amy throws in the ultimate, everyone goes in over the top of the Raptor camp. Shenanigans. The Ash is just, the Sejuani is just going to ult. Oh, TBQ gets nailed by an ult. PYO though answers with the defensive tempered fate. TBQ though already Ooh. dead to punish. I believe Flame, no, he's not quite in the wrong spot. Mid, someone eventually has to ward. They just die. Yeah, Imps overextended. Bye, bye, he's bye. dead now as well. Jeez, that was a lot of damage as Flash Play will actually of UP. And I agree, it's almost been a completely different game. Here we go. Godfrey just gets wrecked by an ulti. Long dives in as Punish takes him out. Flame, he is Megan. I gets a four man ulti as Long goes into the Nexus turrets, but even Flame can't handle all of this. The ulti might keep him alive for a little bit longer, but Imp, no way to free hit. Double kill there for LeBlanc. Imp trying to navigate as best he can. Punish actually dives his way in and Scat is able to get that kill. PYL forced to go through his own turret as Punish dives back in. PYL actually gets a kill onto LeBlanc, but I don't know. So it should be the game. And Turrets at least going to fall. The first one goes in. PYL gets hooked, and he'll get blown up there as well by Scatch. Now TBQ going to be the next target. Goes down, and that's everyone dead. Godvi is back forward to shop up and get ready, and Godvi's caught again. They're yeah, going to get 1v1 here by the Hecarim. That's absurd damage. Amy nails the ulti there as well just to seal the kill, and Long is going to pick up his sixth of the game. And Sichuan. Turret TBQ actually gets chained up there by LeBlanc. Turret's going to go down. Imp's going to get dove on. Dies almost immediately, it looks like, as he's forced to back off towards his fountain. The Nexus is exposed. Punish dies back in for a kill on Flame, doing everything he can, but it's not enough. Unlimited potential are going to split the series one apiece. And the mid lane substitution paid off, and then...